Hello, my name is Jody Moss, Arcturians Transmissions from the Group. And my website is www.arcturians.ca. Today I'd like to talk a little bit about house clearings. Now for me, a house clearing is where I'll go into a living environment and use dowsing techniques to harmonize the energy. I've been doing these kinds of clearings for the last 30 years for residential and commercial properties. And the way I approach it is I use dowsing along with spiritual applications to harmonize the energy in living environments. I do it remotely and I do it on site. What I do simply is I'll go around the outside of the house and I'll use my L rods. And I'm going to use my L rods, just simple rods made with steel and a brass handle. You can make them out of coat hangers and pens, anything that moves freely. And I'll say to my L rods, L rod, show me where the noxious veins of water are. Now noxious veins of water are veins of water that are not in harmony with people. We don't want them in our living environment. So I'll go around the outside of the property and wherever there's a noxious vein of water, I've programmed my L rod to swing to the left. So once I found one, I'll neutralize it using dowsing techniques outside of the property. Once this is done, I move into the into the living environment or working environment. And I, I have a, a multi-leveled system that I've developed over 30 years. And this part of the process, I'll use what I will call a programmed sand. I use sand because under an electron microscope, sand looks like small crystals. So it's very programmable. So this sand has been enhanced with extremely positive energies. And what I'll do is I'll go through starting at the top of the house and working my way down, going through the rooms and being intuitively drawn to an area where I can feel uh, basically energies are not in harmony with the people living there. I will confirm that with my pendulum, simple pendulum that I can carry while I'm doing this. And then when I found a spot that needs some work, I put a pinch of sand there. And what this sand will do over a period of time is free up the energies and, and get them moving and get them clearing. Okay, so I'll start at the top of the house and go all the way down to the basement. Then the next part of the process is where I'll use an incense. I have a special incense that I've developed also, and it's for harmonizing energies in living environments. Now, incense is burned for its vibration, not for its scent. A lot of people buy it because it smells good. It's, that's not the reason to be burning incense. Incense should be treated with respect and used properly. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll start my, and I use charcoal incense, so it has to be burned on charcoal because there's no chemicals put in it to keep it burning. So what I do is I get the people to open the windows upstairs. You have to have windows open to allow it to the, the energies that we want to get rid of, we have to be able to get them out of the building. So the windows are open upstairs and I start in the basement and I go through every room, closets, bathrooms, everywhere. And I work through, I'll, I'll intuitively feel where I need to spend more time. And then I, I work all the way upstairs from the basement to the main floor to the second floor. And if there's a third floor, I just keep going until I'm at the windows and the smoke is going out of the home with the negative energies. Then once that's done, I've worked on several levels now. I've worked outside the house, I've worked with the sand at one level, and I've worked with the incense at another level. So now what I do is I take my L rods and I'm going around and I'm checking the location of the furniture. I don't want people sleeping over intersection lines of uh, Earth's energies because they're not good for you. A lot of people, I've just gone and marked rooms and said, there's a spot on the bed that's not good for someone to sleep on. And they'll just tell me right up, well, I have a back problem and that's exactly where I sleep. So now I go and I'm, I go through the whole house and I'm looking for uh, furniture locates, where their computers are, where do they spend a lot of time. And I make sure that they're not on these intersection lines. And I, I advise them on how to move their furniture. I also look for other influences of geopathic stress or energies coming to the house and I make recommendations on how they can harmonize those. So that's basically a quick version of how I do uh, house clearing, um, residential and commercial. 
And uh, if you'd like more information, feel free to in email me at info at arcturians.ca. Thank you.